Hi, this is Lisa Morantz here at Morantz Ultrasonics, and today this is the part we're going to be cleaning that was sent in for us. Um, you can see it's rather dirty and it's rather heavy. Um, the lift on this machine, that's the grate that you're seeing it sit on, uh, will hold up to 250 pounds, so I know we're nowhere near the weight limit, uh, but uh, it's good that we have the capability to do uh, probably two of these items side by side on here, um, not just because of the side, but uh, also with the weight. So this is the M115 ultrasonic machine uh, that we're using. Right now we do have cleaning solution that we've put inside the machine. Uh, that is our synergizer solution which is typically what we use for parts cleaning. And we also have our activator solution in there, which is a water softener because the water here in Philadelphia is uh, on the hard side. We soften that up so the machine can work to its optimal level. We have the heat right now at 120 degrees Fahrenheit. We probably could add more heat and do this a little bit faster, but this is a very safe heat. Um, we have our ultrasonic generator. We're using uh, the standard uh, generator that comes with this system. So we're using 1500 watts of power which peaks out at 3000 watts and we have two foot switches here. Uh, the black one works the ultrasonic machine and the white one works the lift to go up and down. So right now I'm going to step on the lift foot pedal and you can see that just lower down into the tank. We'll let that settle for just a second and then I'm going to tap onto this foot switch and once I do the sound will cut out so you won't be able to hear my voice but you will be able to see what's happening in the machine. Depending on what we see happening right away uh, I may leave the camera running or I may shut it off and come back to it. Um, this is something that I anticipate will take uh, a bit of cleaning, not like some of the items we do in just minutes. So let's take a look, see what happens.
Okay, we're going to now take uh, the part out of the water. You can see it's completely black. We can't see the bottom. It's been a little over an hour. Uh, we may have left it in a little too long, but we'll, we'll find out. Um, wow, that looks really good. Okay, so you see the paint started coming off, so we definitely did leave it in for too long. So, well, that's good for us to know in the future, unless, unless that's something that you want to do is strip the paint off. But otherwise, it looks terrific. All of that corrosion uh, has been removed. And you can see inside See, that looks pretty good on the inside. So, uh, next time would be good, be good for a shorter increment. We're gonna just let this strip for a little bit and then we'll use our blow dry gun um, after we rinse it off to blow it dry.